Okay, so the final is in six hours, but we got this, guys. Uh, we just need to go over a couple things, I think. So she's definitely going to ask about the structure. So what was that again? Okay, so LDH is a tetramer. There are five different kinds made up of the combo of muscle and heart subunits. It has a secondary structure of about 40% alpha helices and 23% beta sheets. Oh yeah, and the heart has four sub heart subunits and the skeletal muscle has four muscle subunits and the lungs have a combination of the two. What are the differences between the heart and muscle subunits? Oh, okay, so um, the H subunits are found mainly in the heart muscle LDH, which is more specific for the aerobic oxidation of pyruvate, and then the M subunits are mainly found in the liver and skeletal muscle because it's geared towards anaerobic respiration and the reduction of pyruvate. It's nothing. Forbes is always creepy at night. Anyways, <laughs> LDH is important because it helps provide energy for the body, right? Yeah, but how does it do that again? Alright, um, so remember, Dr. Cole talked about how it gives free energy for the reaction of LDH catalyzes. It's about negative 200 kilojoules per mole, but 93% of that energy remains in the lactate. So the reverse of this reaction lets your body use that remaining energy in the lactate. Oh, okay. Yeah, she did talk about that. Oh, and don't forget that LDH has medical uses because it can be used as a diagnostic test for a bunch of health problems, especially a heart attack and tissue damage. Oh, and that's because LDH has two isozymes, right? And a higher level one, like, say, the elevated H type LDH is what lets you know something's wrong. Yeah, that's right. Okay. Okay, awesome. I think uh, we've got most of it. I'm going to go home and take a shower to wake up before the exam, but I'll probably come back in like an hour or so so we can go over more stuff. Okay, sounds okay. good. See you then. Awesome. Good luck. Okay. I'm just tired. I think I'm gonna grab a shower before the exam though. Okay, that's probably a good idea. Yeah. mechanism before I get in the shower. Where did I put my textbook? Oh, I, I guess Carrie's not coming back. She said she's gonna just stay in for the night. But the hours I have left. But um, do you want to go get coffee or something though? Because it's kind of late and I'm having an issue focusing at this point. Yeah, that sounds good. Great. Cool. Let's go. <laughs> Thank you. 
there are a few things that you forgot to study, such as the mechanism, which follows a very ordered sequence. Lactate is oxidized after NAD plus binds to the enzyme, followed by lactate binding to the enzyme. The hydride ion transfers in either direction to yield two tertiary complexes, the enzyme NAD plus lactate and enzyme NADH pyruvate. Pyruvate dissociates from the enzyme, followed by NADH. NADH dissociation is the rate of the step in this reaction. The reverse reaction involves the coenzyme NADH binding first, followed by the substrate, and then pyruvate. The more favorable reaction is the conversion of lactate to pyruvate and regeneration of NAD+. Under conditions, an ATP is largely generated by anaerobic metabolism, such as when oxygen is being depleted, and the ATP demand is high. LDH catalyzes the oxidation of NADH by pyruvate to yield NAD+, and lactate. What is this book doing here? Oh, hi, Sia. How are you? How are you doing? I look a little stressed out. <laughs> I am a little stressed out. Okay. Have you noticed that Carrie's not here? Uh, she texted us saying she wasn't coming. Yeah. Or, um, yeah, she's dead. Oh, okay um, then. A what? <laughs> the final's in three hours. You all killed the curve! Oh god, you're nasty, come on. <laughs> the lab came from the very anaerobic conditions, results in a burning sensation! You now feel in your legs! No! <laughs> <laughs> Yes. I'm nervous. Okay. <laughs> Talk like you would talk. So, um, LDH is pretty awesome and it does this and this, and we're supposed to be studying right now, and this is working really well, isn't it? Uh, the subunits are mainly found in the liver and skeletal muscle because it's geared towards anaerobic respiration and the reduction of pyruvate. You guys are imagining things. Anyways, um, so LDH is important because it helps provide energy for the body, right? Yes. Oh yeah, that's right. Um, Dr. Cole talked about how it gives free energy for the reaction of LDH catalyzes about negative 200 kilojoules per mole, but 93% of that energy remains in the lactate. So the reverse of this reaction lets your body use that energy for the remaining energy is a lot. 